บเพื่อป้าเพียงไรดิสอินสตาเยอร์ทูฟาร์เอ็กซ์เอ็กซ์อาเทโกทีวีอิงค์ a มเจอร์แจแปนิสเบรคัสเตอร์One huge project was about to kick off with the fate of the company at stake. You can really let us go back in time after all this, Teko? Yes! By using my magical redoing brush, I can erase everything you did and rewind the time. All right then. You guys heard that? There is no better time than now. Now is the time for that special project. Let's, Let's do, do it! it! Project. What if we drain the oceans? Hey, what's that machine? That is the Drain All the Oceanator. Our company invested so much to develop it with Metaki Limited. Drain All the Oceanator? Yes. That cube is a cutting-edge instrument that sucks water and spatially transfers it to a designated location. When put in the ocean, it will suck a tremendous amount of seawater and transfer it to the moon, and it can do that at a rate of one million tons per second. We prepared ten of these high-spec ships with the future of Teco Inc at stake, so we can drain the oceans at a speed of ten million tons per second. Um, excuse me, I don't quite get this. Why do you need to do such a thing? Because we can make a wild TV program that's never been done before, of course. Everyone has wondered what happens to our planet if all the oceans got drained. This project scale is just incomparable. This will go down in history for sure. Don't you feel excited too, Teko? Doesn't it stimulate your curiosity? I'm sure it will be a great program, but the world would be in a huge chaos, wouldn't it? That's where you come in. We have you, Teko. If the world turns into chaos, you can just erase what happened, so there's no problem. Uh... All right, get ready, everyone. Yes, sir. Give me the status, Miss Sawa. Yes, sir. All the drain, all the oceanators are in the place. Three each in the Pacific and Atlantic. Two in the Indonesian and one each in the Arctic and Antarctic. We are good to go. Okay. The filming is going as planned. We finished the opening part with the MC and we're gonna film the progress. We're done setting up the satellite cameras. We set three cameras to film the entire surface of the planet. We're ready to shoot. We also set one more camera around the moon, so we can record everything 24 hours, 365 days, from water gradually disappearing from the Earth to water filling the surface of the moon. Wonderful! Turn on all the ships and get started. Let the What If We Drain the Oceans project begin! Uh, a year later. It's been a year since we started the project, but honestly, not much changed, huh? Uh, Miss Sawa, are all the drain the oceanators properly working? Yes, those ten ships are working without any problems. Spatially transferring seawater to the moon at 10 million tons per second. As you can see from the videos taken from the satellite cameras, the moon is gradually getting filled with water. I see. But. Oh. I think we underestimated this. Based on the data that the sea level lowered only one meter after a year of those ships working, it would take 4,400 years till we get all the seawater transferred to the moon. Oh, that long? Oh no, we totally underestimated the ocean. We can't achieve it even if we had 50 more lives. Yeah. Okay, get 200 more drain all the oceanators. <gasps> If your math is right, we need 200 more of those ships to drain all the seawater from the Earth in 20 years or so. But it will cost an enormous fortune. It'll be fine. After this project is done, everything is going to go back to normal. So you guys don't need to worry about anything. Just make more of those. Yes, yes sir. sir. Uh, three years later since the project started. How is it going? Everything is as planned, sir. It took a year to produce 200 more drain all the oceanators, but the sea level lowered by 200 meters. The Japanese archipelago has connected with Eurasia. Then it became a massive continent combined with the continent of Africa. Also, Australia and Indonesia are connected. More and more islands are showing up on the surface. 
Wow! Ten years later. How is the operation going? Everything is well, sir. Compared to when we started, the sea level went down by 1.5 km. As you can see, all the continents became one big land except for Antarctica. And as you know, countries are resetting national borders. The world is in chaos. Fascinating! 20 years later. How was the project? Everything is under control. The sea level went down by 5 km since the beginning. Currently, the land accounts for the majority of the Earth's surface rather than the ocean. The concept of nations has collapsed since all the continents were connected and the world went into chaos. Therefore, the world government was established to lead the entirety of humanity. Wow! And few years later, the What If We Drain the Oceans project was completed. All the seawater was drained from the Earth's surface. Instead, the moon became a planet of water. This, uh, what if we drain the oceans project was finally completed after 25 years of us at Teco TV working on it. Finally, we drained all the seawater from the earth. The oceans are completely gone. The earth has become a dangerous place. Seawater played an important role in adjusting the temperature on earth. It absorbed the sunlight and reflected it. The warm water that is heated by the sun flew towards the north and south poles. Then, the cold seawater flew towards the equator. Thus, the seawater was keeping the Earth's temperature from getting too warm or too cold. But, if there's no water in the oceans, those powerful sun rays would burn the equator and wouldn't hit the north or south poles at all. At the same time, it would hardly rain. Most plants would dry out, and plus the earth would get extremely dry and fires would start in many areas. Those fires are the scariest things. It hastens global warming because of the increased emission of CO2. The temperature on earth is raised to 67 degrees Celsius. The places near the equator have become a burning hell. Our drinking water is barely remaining in lakes, ponds, icebergs, and the underground. We don't have a choice but to watch it dry out. Moreover, those fires I mentioned earlier are going to use more and more oxygen. Even if we could survive the extremely hot weather and get enough drinking water, humanity would suffocate and go extinct in the end. Those are things that happened on Earth when we drained all the water from the sea. And cut! Let's check the video! We finished filming the impossible. Yes, the world is completely collapsed and we're barely alive. Teko! Oh. It took us a very long time, but we filmed what people have never seen before. This should do it. So, as promised, could you fix everything to how it was before? We put the world through unprecedented events. Everything will be back to normal if you could just rewind the time. We will put this innovative show on air in the redone world 25 years ago. I want to do that, but let me ask you this one thing. I thought this is the beginning. Oh? If I use my redoing brush and rewind the time, everything you filmed for these 25 years will vanish completely. Are you okay with this? <gasps> oh. Thank you very much for watching this video. Hope you have enjoyed. Please subscribe my channel and give me a lots of likes. Good luck.